All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, hitting the good old fashioned Home Depot. All right, today is a job. It's a soft roof cleaning or a wash or whatever you want to call it. Um, if you if you have any kind of mildew, you have any kind of moss or buildup, or your shingles got the black streaks, okay. What you're gonna do is you're gonna clean it. You're gonna clean it the way I'm gonna clean it today. All right, and uh, whatever you do, you never ever use a power wash on your roof because it will take the lifetime of that shingle and all the granules, it'll take it right off and you'll reduce that to 10, 15 years at least. All right, so stay tuned. We're gonna go grab what we need. A couple of simple, simple ingredients. The roofing cleaning companies out there will never tell you what the stuff is. It's very inexpensive. And I'll show you how to mix it. I'm gonna show you what you use and we're gonna go through the process and that'll be it. Pretty sweet looking truck right here. What is this? That's an F-150, kid. All right, well, we'll see you soon. Let's get into the store and get what we need. All right, first thing you do is get on the app, pull up what you're looking for. It tells me aisle one, bay 11. So you know those numbers up there, like where the three is, that's the aisle number, obviously. And then the bays are the little numbers on the side. So let's take a look. This one's one. And here we go, these are all the different bleaches, and yes, we're gonna use bleach. That's one of the ingredients. So you wanna look for, not your normal bleach you get in a grocery store, but something a little bit stronger, okay? Okay, we're gonna go with this guy here. And it is 4.48 a gallon. Let me grab a couple of these. All right, after going through Home Depot and all the bleaches, I did find this guy here. All right, it's the outdoor bleach, okay? You're gonna mix parts of this here, up to 30 gallons, okay? You can have mixed with water. You're gonna get yourself a sprayer, all right? This is an inexpensive uh, sprayer you can use for, you know, sealing decks, okay? Um, so you mix the two gallons of water and you wanna put some of the Blue Dawn soap in, okay? You mix it all around I and mean, that's it. You're gonna mix this up. Okay, we're gonna grab our ladder, um, which is the Gorilla ladder. I'll tell you what, this is the nice, this is the nice one. It's an MPX 22, so it's a 22 foot ladder. And we're gonna bring it out up on the roof up there, all right? And we're gonna show you how we apply this. Very simple, okay? Okay, we're up on the roof now. You know, put your ladder up against the roof. If you don't know how to put a ladder up, I suggest you don't do any of this kind of work until you learn how to use a ladder. I'm a little winded because I've been sick the last couple days. But uh, I'm starting to get better. Now, see all the moss? Okay. This moss, if you look close, is literally embedded in this asphalt or tar or whatever this is you can pull some of it off the problem is is the stuff that's embedded okay if you start to dig at it some of the tighter stuff like this you can start to damage the actual roofing so what we're going to do is we're going to spray it with the, the mixture and it's going to kill all this and it's going to release it on its own and the rain, believe it or not, will wash a lot of it away, okay? So stay tuned, we're gonna pump this sprayer up, and then we're going to, uh, we're gonna give it uh, a nice overspray. All right, so stay tuned. Okay, very simple, you turn the uh, handle here, and you pump it up and down. So I'm gonna pump it maybe, uh, Keep pumping until it gets pretty hard to push down. Okay. And then lock it in place. Give it a little shake. We'll grab the nozzle. Do a little test spray. Right, you see it? You're just going to get it over the moss. Believe it or not, it will kill this stuff. So I'm going to go over it real quick. 
All right. And when it's finished, we're going to let it sit. All right, so that's it. Spray the whole roof. I sprayed it over twice. I actually sprayed the entire roof. That'll promote any other future growth, at least until next spring, okay? He's got someone coming to clean his gutters in a couple of days. It'll give this stuff time to dry, and it'll start doing its job. I'll come up here in about three to four weeks, and I'll take a quick look, and we'll see what it looks like from then. But that's how you do it. That's how you clean a roof. Now, if you have a three-tab shingle, and you have those black streaks coming down, that is a form of a fungus or an algae. You could use the same mix, okay? Start from the top, obviously. Spray back and forth. Let it run down. And the rain will actually wash it all away. All right? Again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and most of all, like the video. So it can uh, go to other people and get around YouTube a lot quicker. All right? Take care. Have a good day.